<laughs> What's going on guys? Daily fishing here. If you want to catch decent fish like this, early ice, make sure you check out this video. What's going on guys? I'm out here with Nolan. We're fishing for some walleye on some back lakes. The water here is pretty murky. The weather is completely overcast. It's snowing. The temperature is about negative five. Let's see what else we can get today. I have a tip up over there. I'm gonna be throwing down a jigging wrap. What a jigging wrap is, this one's called a shiver minnow. It's made by Moonshine Lures. I just upgraded the hook, put a bigger hook on it and then I tipped it with a minnow head. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna drop it down 15 feet of water. There's my lure. So I'll bring it down to the 13 foot range and then I'll just jig it like so. And when you're jigging it and a fish comes, all you gotta do is you pull it away a little bit and just give it a couple little taps. Tap, 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 tap. And then you big jig again, big ones, big ones, big ones. Then if it follows you up again, just tap it just so, ever so slightly. But when there's no fish, you wanna be jigging this thing pretty erratically. See that? And then when it comes in, you Tap, 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 ever so lightly. All right, this fish is spooling me out right now, so let's let's get it. You ready? <laughs> One, two, three. Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah. Oh dude, it feels pretty good. Oh, it's a walleye, dude. Look at the size it's of that It's a decent freaking one. Oh, 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 oh my gosh. Dude, I seen that. That's a good one. Oh, frick yeah, buddy. You see the size of that thing? Dude, I see, I, I seen the head, man. Yeah. I thought it was going to be a pike, not a walleye. Dude, it looked like a pike, too. It's but a, like, it's a walleye, dude. No, but it was long like a pike. Oh, frick yeah. Oh, it's a monster, dude. It's oh. a freaking monster. Oh, do I see it? <laughs> oh, there it is. Look at that. Oh, yeah, buddy. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Woo! It's a nice one, boys. Holy smokes. Look at that head shape. Oh, nice, man. Look at this freaking thing. Oh. Let's get it up to the hole. Come on, come on. Oh, yeah. That's a good walleye right there. Come on, let's go. Woo! That's a good one right there. There we go. Check that thing out, boys. Nice. Sweet. Let's see if this thing's buried. Oh no, it's right there. That's a great fish right there. That's a nice fish. All right guys, let's get this beauty back. Out of season. 
There it goes. No pictures taken. Oh, crap. There we go. No pictures taken. All right, go back now, buddy. Woo! What's going on guys? So midday update. We caught one walleye and one uh, large mouse. So yeah, it's, it's been a really hard day today. So um, yeah, we'll just keep you updated as the day progresses and hopefully we can start smashing them soon. So let's talk about walleye fishing. When you're a walleye fishing, we usually like to use jigging wraps or puppet minnows or uh, shiver minnows. Here are some of the ones that I personally have in my collection. And I just thought I would share it with you guys. So right there at the very top, we got a jig and wrap, a couple bass dash ones, the puppet minnows right there. Um, I think that's shad wrap. Or yeah, it's jig and shadow wraps right there. And then shiver, two shiver minnows on the bottom. I got one on my line right now. Um, and then the rest of those, other than the top one, the top one's a freedom. The other ones right there are all jig and wraps. So yeah, I thought I'd share my collection. That's what I got going on right now. And yeah, so there's some help if you're in the market of looking for some lures. Those are some colors. You can just slow down if you want and take a look at what I have. So that's also how I store them. The bottom of this is a uh, foam. So it's plastic hard case, foam on the bottom. You gotta store it like that with some foam or something because when you're snowmobiling or when you're walking out, they'll just rattle all around. And when they rattle around, you break the fins off them. So you have to figure out something to use. This box is completely full. So you're gonna have to either pick up another box or uh... yeah. So I'm gonna have to pick up another box, but whatever, they're a great lure. So I strongly suggest picking some up. So we're losing light pretty quickly. We had an all right day. Just finishing it up, jigging. If we catch any more, I'll throw it in the video.